Uh, namaste guys in this video we are going to learn how to make this in blender uh, just to know that i saw this thing in software called katia on pinterest so i thought hey uh, let's try to make it in blender so let's start so press a x and delete now go to the add mesh and click on circle press 7 on your numpad now press g x and move 2.5 select this press tab uh, press 2 for the selection mode ok now press e enter and scale it in inward direction after that what you have to do is select this edge up to by pressing ctrl up to this ok uh, make sure it's equal now press e x and move it forward press s y 0 sorry s x 0 uh, press g x and move it up to here go here and click on mirror ok for mirror i wanted it mirror about this point uh, center of origin so what i can do go to the add empty and click on plane axis so click on it click on here click on mirror and select the empty so basically empty telling hey that it is mirroring about this uh, this location as you can see it is not uh, merged so what i can do press tab select this press g x and merge it like this okay so now it is merged before i apply this press a press ctrl r and enter the number of loop cuts here after that i will apply this select so this as you can see uh, top project is okay now what i can do go here and click on simple deform uh, bend y let's choose empty Uh, it's like this let's see which axis yeah so if i rotate along y axis and enter the value of 90 so this is how to flex in band so let's increase this band to 60 uh 60 is fine i guess so uh let's click on here and click on apply select this press tab Go to the selection mode, select all the outside edges, press E and Z and move it downwards, press S, Z, 0, uh, looks good to me. Now after that, press 1, uh, select all these and press G, Z, move it little bit downwards more. After I press A, press Ctrl R. Okay, this much is fine. So, what I can do right now is in face section mode, I will select uh, some faces. As you can see, the faces are selected on both sides. So, press I for insert, right click, go to the loop tools, and click on circle. Just in case if loop tools is not showing, go to edit, preferences, add-ons and type loop tools. It is an inbuilt free add-on given by Blender, so you don't have to worry about paying anything else. So loop tools, circle, um, let's scale it down. Uh, click on here click on individual origins a question is why individual origins so, uh, currently i doesn't click on individual origins so if i press scaling down you can see it is not giving me the desired results but if i click on individual origins and if i press scale down you see i am getting my desired results so okay that is the reason i am doing that now press i again 
I again. Okay. And right click loop to bridge. Now, what we can do, uh, right click, shade smooth, go here, normals, auto smooth, and let's apply some subdivision surface. Uh, you can see how it looks like, but let's try this, just two, and select all these edges. And let's make a hair little bit uh, bevel. So press Ctrl B. Uh, before I do that, uh, press Ctrl A and apply scale so that our bevel is equal. Similarly, press Alt Shift. Alt Shift, press Ctrl V, oh, oh okay, <laughs> there is no bevel can be applied because there is no thickness, so sorry my bad, I was wondering why there is no bevel, so this is how it looks like, now let's add some thickness. Uh, so solidify I think that's it is info. so I will increase the thickness yep that's good to me so make sure it's even thickness and I think it looks okay click on here click on apply uh, you see it's not look good to here so what I can do so alt shift and all shift uh, sorry all shift like this edge and all shift like this edge all shift and all shift press ctrl b for bevel make sure bevel is not too high so that's how you can make this part I think looks good or is a simple you know sort of uh, it's a simple uh, blender exercise for CAD modeling let's be well these as well control B so if I see now you can see they have quite good sharp edges so if you have any kind of doubts inquiries feel free to ask and I hope you learn something from this video and Thanks for watching and have a great day. Namaste.